I want to spend a few minutes just talking about what I think is a, is a gross misconception about how the process of building a custom home should start. Because I think um, the, the, intuitive, the, in, the intuitive way that most people think about this is, well, I'll, I'll go out and I'll buy a piece of land, uh, and then I'll find an architect, and maybe an engineer, and maybe a surveyor, and so on and so forth. And you take all of those steps before you sit down and talk to a competent builder. I really think that that's backwards. I think one of the first things that anybody should do if they're thinking about a custom home, sit down and talk to a competent builder about cost, about features, about construction techniques, and about special things that you want in that house. A competent builder should be able to take just a very rough concept plan. Let's say you found a concept plan that you like and maybe it's Maybe it's from the internet, maybe it's in a book, maybe you saw something at a parade of homes, but you've got a basic concept plan. And I believe a competent builder can take a concept plan, just a very rough concept, and be able to give you a very good idea of what your construction costs are gonna be. That's a far better way to start, because if you do that, it may impact the size of the acreage that you buy or the size of the lot you buy, it may impact the design that you ask your architect to draw. It'll almost certainly impact some of the features that you put in the house, the, the level of appliances that you choose, the types of windows that you choose, the type of roofing that you choose. There's a lot of impacts. There's a lot of things that a preliminary cost forecast or a preliminary cost estimate will impact. It'll help you to make far better choices, far more intelligent choices. It'll help you to do far better planning right from the very start and that that impact of better planning better forecasting right from the start is going to carry all the way through to the day you move into that house so start with a basic concept start with a rough estimate from a competent builder that's a far better way to go than to go out and buy 300 400 500 thousand dollars worth of land spend 30 40 50 thousand dollars on an architect and then find out wait a minute we can't really build the house that we wanted. We've gone too far already. So start, start with a rough estimate. Super important concept.